Hey there, everyone. My name is Nathan. I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assess clients from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our clients most frequently ask us to perform is the removal of the Google Account Lock security feature on an Android device. Here with us today, we happen to have a Galaxy Note 9 that actually does have the lock enabled. As we can see here, at, during the setup wizard, we get to the screen that says that the device was reset and to continue to sign in with the account that was previously on the device. For those of you who may not be familiar with it, the Google account lock was something that was set up by Google back in Android 5 as a security measure to kind of help combat some of the theft and fraud that happens around mobile devices these days. So basically, it means that when the device is factory reset without first removing the Google account that's on it, it's then going to ask for that same account again after the factory reset, kind of like we're seeing just here on the device itself. So we're making this video to let all of our clients know that we do offer a service to be able to bypass that lock on the device if you're in need of it without having to have the login, uh, the email and the password information. That's actually something that we're running right here right now on our program, our computer program as it's plugged in. And in just a second, we should be able to see that after we restart the device, it should come back up without that lock there. And we've had tons of customers contact us over the years who have needed help with this service. Most clients either accidentally got themselves locked out of their phone because they couldn't remember their screen lock or because their kid accidentally did a factory reset or whatever the situation may be. And then they didn't remember their password or they couldn't get their account information reset for whatever the situation was. Or unfortunately, the other situation is that also these days there are a lot of dishonest sellers out there who will sell a device that has the lock enabled but not inform the buyer about it. So the buyer unfortunately doesn't know any better to check for it and then when they go through to set up the device as a new one with their own information, they run into the lock and then obviously they're not able to get past it. So again, we're making this video to let anyone know that we do offer a service to be able to remove the lock using our computer programs and tools without having to have the actual account information. It can be done for almost anyone anywhere in the world, just as long as they have a decently powerful Windows computer and a fast internet connection. You just plug in the device with the USB cable and then we run through and do the same procedure that we would do if we had the phone here in hand. Our program here is just finishing up. It just needs another couple seconds to get finished. And then we should be able to see that after we restart the device, it should be able to go through and we should be able to get all the way through the setup process as normal as if it was a brand new device out of the box without seeing that lock there. So give me just a minute here to wrap up with our computer program. Okay. I think that should do it. So if we go ahead and just do a restart here, we should be able to see that once it reboots, we should be all good to go. So of course we've got the Note 9 insignia. And then Samsung. And this just happens to be a T-Mobile device, so it's going to show their logo here while turning on. Okay, so everything's starting up now, so we can start going through the setup process. Let me help you get set up more easily. Let's We're going to tap Start. And then we can go ahead and we can actually just skip through Wi-Fi now. Let's look at the terms and conditions. Going to keep going through. It's going to ask us for our name now, which is a good sign because that is not something that it was asking for before. It actually came up with the Google lock before. Now we see Google services. And we're going to skip that. We're going to skip all of the Samsung stuff. And skip one more thing. There's some more T Mobile information here. We're just going to skip that. And there we go. So we're at the home screen now. The Google lock has been fully bypassed and we have access to all the features and functions on the device. And then we're going to jump into the settings real quick just to show you what we're working with, just so it's clear. So again, we can see here that we are working with a Galaxy Note 9 there with the model number, the N960U, which is the model number of all of the US versions of the Note 9. So this can be done for any Note 9, regardless of which company or carrier it originally came from. 
So if you have a Galaxy Note 9 and need to get the Google account lock removed from it, we would love to help you out with that. So go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact information will be right down in the video description. And then I'll also put a slide here at the end of the video that has all the information there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out all the other videos that we have on our channel as we offer a lot of different services for a lot of different devices, and I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy. Make sure to hit that subscribe button while you're there also to be notified of all the new videos and services that we're constantly adding, just like this one. Y para todos los hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great day.